Hi everyone. Welcome back to Academics Global. In today's video, I will be showing you a complete beginner's tutorial on Nitro PDF, one of the best tools for creating, editing and managing PDF files. By the end of this video, you will know how to open, edit, convert and secure PDFs using Nitro. Nitro PDF is a professional PDF editor that can let you create, edit, sign and share PDF files but with a simpler interface. Let's start the tutorial of Nitro PDF. On the above, first you can you can see this folder which is to open the document. Then you can see the floppy disk which is for saving and print option and undo your task and redo your previously undone action. Then the touch and mouse mode and finally the customize quick access toolbar. Below is the ribbon on which you can see different tabs. I will first click on the file. Here you can see you can open a new PDF document. You can create a new PDF document or open a already available PDF document. You can best print. You can select the preferences or you can exit. I will open the document by a different procedure which is to track the file here in Nitro PDF. Here this is the PDF file. I will drag it into the Nitro and you can see it's open. You can open the document by dragging the PDF into the Nitro PDF software. Uh, so the first option in the file tab is hand. I am clicking the hand. By this option you can move the document above or below. Then the there is option of zoom. You can zoom on any area of the document. And here you can also zoom or zoom in or zoom out. The next option is to fit the document and I am clicking on the fit width. So this document is fit on its width and I can also fit page. Yes. And we can also rotate the document. Here it is. I will click one more time, one more time and one more time. Now you can see it is on the same position. And then the option is select uh, I can select anywhere on this document by this option then the option uh, the feature is type text yes I can type anything here and then it's quick signature uh, as I, I have already uh, made this academic signature but I can also manage or create this signature like I want to delete it okay and I want to create the new signature 
uh, from the handwritten option and here in this okay and close and now i can add the signature anywhere in the document and double click here it is placed the next important feature is to create a pdf from file or scanner here i click on the from file uh, i can add files on or i can drag files like i want to create pdf of this academics combined picture here i drag and create now it will ask you to save where you want i will save here and create it is processing now you can see the picture is converted into the pdf document uh, you can also combine the uh, different pdf documents in similar way i will skip this uh, step and you can also convert this uh, document to word excel powerpoint or image or to other like rich text plain text or you can also extract images i will convert it into the word file and i want to convert the first five pages into word and i want to save it the output file output word file on the same folder folder of the original file it is processing here you can see it is converted into image the five next uh, i will do is to image like i want to convert the first page into image it is converted but it is in the uh, temporary folder here you can see the first page is converted into the picture the now we will move move forward towards the edit tab uh, here Uh, we have already used the hand zoom and select tool now i will click on the edit and by clicking on the edit you can edit the text here i can delete any word and type i can change the size of the and i can also change the color if i want i will undo the changes 
and then the OCR option which is for the scan documents. You can make the scan docs documents searchable and editable. Uh, then the next feature is add image. I can add image to this document anywhere from any file. Like I will select this image and here it is added and I will delete this image. Then the next uh, feature is insert. I can insert any document into this uh, book like I want to add this statdx book add. Uh, here it will ask that where you want to insert like I want to insert all because it is the one page document and I want to add it the on the first page before the first page. I want to make it the first page. Here you can see the first page is the static set. Uh, then I can delete this page as well. Delete and delete current page. The current page is one. So I will delete it. Yes. And then I can also extract a range of pages from this PDF document. I can replace, I can rotate on any direction and I can split, I can crop like this. I want to crop this part of this page. Like I want to only crop this. Here you can see. Like I want, uh, I want to crop this part. Okay. Crop. Yeah. You can see this page, this part of this page is cropped. Then you can add and manage the header and footer. As well. Or you can remove Okay. Uh, because this page doesn't include any header and footer, it shows error. Like here you can uh, like I have already added this new profile of academics. I can apply uh, Like I want to apply the page number on the footer. You can see the pages number on the footer. Similar, you can add any header as well. And then the option is Bates number and the uh, watermark option and bookmarks and links. I will move towards the review tab now. Here you can add notes like here you and want to add any notes you want notes and then you can also mark the text you want highlight the text or mark the text 
it is good for uh, highlighting the important uh, points in your document and then i can also add the shapes as well like the arrow if i want and i can also add the drawing and i can also add the text box here and i can also add the stamp options like if any task is urgent or it is uh, paid here i can add okay i can also measure the document distance like i am want to measure horizontally on this page it shows 8.43 inches uh no uh, 8.5 inches and then i can attach files and other collaborate summarize commands i can migrate hide commands and identity and i can compare and whiteboard i will now i will move to the next tab which is forms here you can add checkbox and you can uh, add the create a field which enables the user to generate the barcode from the selected fields there is a radio button combo box list box button and digital signature and the javascript tab order import export and reset and you can also show grids and also snap to grids the next option which is uh, tab is protect which is very important you can also mark the content and you can secure your protect your document by password Uh, here you can add password and you can make it protect it and you can also and the next feature is cloud you can request signature share the document collaborate and many more the next step is help uh, the user guide product tour about the nitro knowledge base ideas asking questions checking updates and the next is properties you can and there are multiple option but these are not important and alignment you can also make your own alignments so that's a quick review of how to use nitro pdf for your everyday needs from editing and converting to securing and sharing files if you find this tutorial helpful please give it a thumbs up subscribe to academics global and turn on the bell icon for more productivity tutorials drop your questions in the comments and i will be happy to answer